James Edward Jim Doherty was an American policeman, best known for being the first husband of Marilyn Monroe. Early life, Doherty's grandparents were immigrants from England and Ireland. Doherty himself was born in Texas. He was the youngest in a family of four children born to Ethel and Edward Doherty, natives of Pueblo, Colorado, who moved to Globe, Arizona, when he was an infant. They relocated to Los Angeles County, California during his adolescence. He attended Van Nuys High School, graduating in 1939 alongside Jane Russell, where he was active in theater and a member of the football team. Marriages, Doherty was married three times. His first marriage was to Marilyn Monroe. While working part-time and living with his parents, Doherty met Monroe when she was 15 and he was 20. They began dating. Monroe's foster family was moving away and couldn't take Monroe with them, so her foster mother suggested that Doherty marry the underage Monroe, who otherwise may have had to return to an orphanage. In a later interview with the A&E Network, he said that his own mother also wanted him to marry Monroe. On June 19, 1942, Doherty and Monroe married at the home of his friend Chester Howell in Los Angeles. After they met, she affectionately nicknamed him Jimmy. In 1943, Doherty joined the United States Merchant Marine. Prior to that he had worked with Robert Mitchum in a defense plant. He was ordered to boot camp on Santa Catalina Island, California, where Norma Jean lived with him. In 1944, he was sent overseas, much to Norma Jean's dismay. Norma Jean started to work for Radioplane Company where she was included in a series of morale-boosting photographs, launching her career as a model and actress. She moved out of her mother-in-law's home and stopped writing to Doherty. She filed for divorce in Las Vegas, Nevada, while he was in Shanghai, China. It was finalized on September 13, 1946. In the book To Norma Jean with Love, Doherty stated he was so depressed after his breakup with Monroe that he considered taking his own life, but he could not bear the thought of his mother finding his body. Doherty's second marriage was to Patricia Scoman in 1947, which was around the time he joined the LAPD. They had three daughters, Cheryl Ann Doherty, Vivian Kathleen Doherty, and Mary Irene Dotry. The couple divorced in 1972. In 1974, Doherty married a third time, to Rita Lambert. The couple relocated to her native Maine, settling in Sabatas. They were married until her death in 2003. He was noted to have become more outspoken about his relationship with Monroe after marrying Lambert. In 1997, Doherty commented, I love her, but I'm not in love with her. There's a lot of difference between loving someone and being in love. Other work, he was one of the police officers who held back the crowd at the premiere of Monroe's 1950 movie, The Asphalt Jungle, although she was never present at the event herself. Doherty later appeared on To Tell the Truth as Marilyn Monroe's real first husband. During a CNN appearance, Doherty informed Larry King that an LAPD officer, Jack Clemens, called him only minutes after he had found Monroe dead. According to To Norma Jean with Love, he explains that when New York Times asked him to comment on her death, Doherty replied, I'm sorry, and continued his LAPD patrol. Equals books equals, The Secret Happiness of Marilyn Monroe, Buccaneer Books, 1976, To Norma Jean with Love, Jimmy, Beach House Books, 2001, ISBN 978-1-888725-1. Into Norma Jean with Love, Doherty wrote that they were in love but dreams of stardom lured her away. She always maintained theirs was a marriage of convenience. She was furious when he told Photoplay in 1953 she threatened to jump off the Santa Monica Pier if he left her. In a 1956 interview she said that she attempted suicide during the marriage, that she felt trapped and bored by Doherty, and that they married at the behest of her foster mother. Doherty said in his books that he did not mind his wife modeling. Conversely, his sister wrote in the December 1952 issue of Modern Screen magazine that Doherty left Norma Jean because she decided to pursue modeling and he didn't like the attention it created. Doherty told Lifetime's intimate portrait that he cut off her monthly allotment when he was served with divorce papers. 
to Norma Jean with love also references this. Equals Marilyn's Man Equals, Doherty was also featured in a 2004 documentary, called Marilyn's Man. On August 7, 2008, a main judge, who found that substantial fraud had occurred, ordered documentary producer Shani Krug to repay more than $500,000 and interest to Doherty's heirs and investors in the documentary. Lawyers said Krug spent investors' money on himself and injured parties never received promised proceeds from the documentary. Death, Doherty died on August 15, 2005 in Marin, California of complications related to leukemia. He was 84 years old. References The Marilyn Encyclopedia by Adam Victor External links, James Doherty at the Internet Movie Database, James Doherty at Find a Grave